Hi, my name is Will Schumann from Ringro here in Alice, Alabama. Here to introduce you to our uh, cryoethanol system from Better Industries in China. Show you the pros and cons of what we experienced here during the installation, but also during the production. And then from after the extraction room, we'll move into the distillation room and show you our short path distillation equipment as well as our glass reactors and the full process here at Ringro in Aliceville, Alabama. Let's go. First off, we, we purchased the 300 liter uh, low temperature solvent extraction system. When, you, when this system arrives, the very first thing you'll notice is extreme high quality. We've been very impressed by that, particularly the welds. The manufacturing quality is superb. Um, really, really exceeded our expectations when it comes to that. Uh, there's definitely some cons, but we'll get to those later. But uh, first, we'll talk about a lot of the pros. Uh, very, very simple uh, system to operate. That was probably the best thing for us as that literally after installation, it'll only take a few days to a week for your production team to start to become pretty efficient. They'll certainly know the equipment, and then in time they'll become very proficient with it in due course as they operate it on a daily basis. But you'll see here, it's an extraction tank where your biomass actually is inserted in the beginning, and then the process begins from the introduction of a of a, of a chilled solvent or very cold, negative 40 degrees Celsius, ethanol or other alcohol solvent, we enter to the tank and then go through a process of extraction here over to uh, evaporators and other parts of the system. One of the great things is the controls are very, very simple. Everything is right here. Uh, the, insist the system came with everything you need to install from the switches to the cables to the stands. So for this, this was very beneficial. Uh, it's also easily modifiable. So if you do get this system into a building and you find that you have some impediments for uh, actually for the construction or for the installation of the equipment, almost everything can very easily with, a, with, with these stainless steel pipes, 304 stainless steel, You've got fittings, all of this can be found in the United States, so if you need to modify any parts of the plant, you can do so very easily. Back to the cons, uh, one of the things you'll notice is most of the electrical drawings you will receive from China. One great improvement to the system, which I know that uh, Better is working on now, is to improve the drawings for the U.S. market. But it, it's very high quality, again, you see our transformer here three-phase dry type power transformer, connects very easily with US power. Uh, as far as the extraction equipment is concerned, this was a very simple, straightforward installation. Any US electrician will easily be able to install this system at your plant. The other interesting aspect, again, air power doesn't require any very specialized ancillary or peripheral equipment. Uh, we have a small cobalt air compressor here that does the job for us. One of the more complicated parts of the system really is the introduction of liquid nitrogen. So there are some requirements here that you may want to look at prior for this system's arrival, particularly pads. Uh, we're, we're in a local, very rural location here in Aliceville. So this is not an industrial site. We built this from the ground up. Uh, so some of this sort of modification was required before we were able to actually install the nitrogen system. So check on that before your system arrives. Electrical panel here, again, amazing. Uh, we just installed this system. So this, ins this entire area will be enclosed. That construction is ongoing now. And that just provides safety for residual solvents and things like that in the room. But I mean, this is an incredibly well-built panel. Everything is self-explanatory, very easy to operate this system. It's modular as well, so it's easy to add on to this system in due course. And all of that, uh, the system controls are integrated in this panel, which again means it's very quick to operate. Learning curve is very quick, and your teams will be able to learn and be proficient on this system in a short time. So as you can see, uh, high quality installation here, um, high quality construction. 
Very easy to install. Took us about three days total after setup. So uh, pretty self-explanatory. Drawings were useful. And as you can tell, not, not super complicated to get uh, up and running. Now we'll go in here to our distillation room. So our short path distillation equipment, as you can see here. So this is some of the extracted material from our biomass, from our hemp grown here on site. So this is actually the raw material or the crude oil that's been extracted from the flour in the extraction room using the cold solvent extraction. We then bring that in here. One of the things, uh, if you're new to hemp processing, that I'll warn you about is this stuff is extremely messy, viscous, and somewhat hard to deal with. So in our case, we're using some stainless steel pots. And keep in mind, we've only had this installed for about three days. So we're still trying to, to figure out the best method of relocating that oil into here and then into the short path distillation. We use a very small cooktop induction cooktop with stainless steel pots so that we can warm this up after we've removed it from the machine. 